They will open with Gail Gilbert in the backfield along with Ron Story and Dwight Garner. Andy Bark, a transfer from the Air Force at one wide receiver. Andy Bark, number 42, is at the top of your screen wide to the left. Rance McDougal wide right, play fake, half roll. Gail Gilbert has a great long touch and Bark is open. Down at the one. 51 yards. A crossing route. He's double covered. Bark at number 42 is double covered. 4-7 speed. Not exceptional. Tremendous clutch player. Beats both players. Reggie Dupee, number 15. And Damani Price, number 24, had just let him slip behind. Blitz again. Gilbert near side to Andy Bark. And Bark picks up about seven to the 34-yard line before Terry Brown. Number 40 comes in. Smith back in at quarterback. Gilbert play fake. Will throw from his own end zone. Puts it up on the sideline. Caught by Andy Bark. Reggie Dupee with a tackle. Bark is an interesting kid. Two years at the Air Force Academy. He suffered a couple of concussions. And he told me yesterday that when he was uh, told he couldn't fly, he decided to transfer. Steve? Andy Bark, again, a real pressure receiver down the sidelines. It really appeared that he stepped out of bounds, but maybe he didn't. And 16. Gilbert back to throw with time this time. Nobody open, though, and finally fires it out for Andy Bark. And did he make that catch? Yes, he did. Kid's amazing. He's only six feet, 175 pounds. The catch, the catch in the Arizona game was as good as anything I've seen on film. Watch this. Right at, right at the sidelines, Andy Bark, 42. Good protection by the Cal offensive line this time. Kenny Taylor will be defending right there. Saw the top half of his body, but right where it had to be. Excellent concentration. That's not an easy catch to make. It's third and 28. Gilbert with time. Andy Bark first uh, has the catch. Andy Bark gets his third. There's a cross done inside. There's DeLulo, number 70, trying to come around. Good protection this time by the Cal. Plenty of time by the quarterback. He's going to hit Bark, 42. Too much cushion by the secondary. P 15. Free safety's got to make that play. Want to hear something that won't surprise you about Andy Bark? He's majoring in the political economies of industrial societies and told me yesterday he wants to go into television. Yeah, when Joe Staff is here. Here's Gilbert back to throw it. Lost it left side. Andy Bark wide open. They're giving him a huge cushion. And he's got a first down at the 43 with his sixth catch today. Bob Johnson, the linebacker. Drifted back to make the stop on the six-foot senior. Oregon State is so concerned about giving up the big play, they're giving way too much cushion. Andy Bark's going to, there's not going to be a defender within 10 yards of Andy Bark. Gail Gilbert, all the time in the world. Uh, Sparkowski, who's not been traded. Gilbert will throw it. Who else but Andy Bark, his seventh catch today. Senior out of Palos Verdes Estates. Blitz. They beat it. Andy Bark. His ninth catch today. Sort of a semblance of a running game because it will help your passing attack. What is really surprising with the great tight end David Lewis out of the ball game, we knew the wide receivers would have more pressure. Thunderbird. Fumble. Seen in Berkeley. Gilbert two-step drop. Andy Bark with his tenth catch. And then he just squirts around and gets out an additional two yards. Bark has caught 10 for 150 yards now. Isolated on Andy Bark, number 42, has really had a good day. This time just goes five steps, turns inside, the defender's off, looks the ball in, and then makes a little extra play. Dupee, number 15, has to make the tackle. Again, the good cushion, giving the receivers a lot of opportunity. Blitz is on. Gilbert gets rid of it. Andy Bark, as Reggie Dupee makes the tackle. Giorgio back to throw it again. Caught. And that'll bring up third and nine. Fourth and nine. Andy Bark with his 12th catch. The record of catches in a game for California is 13. Andy Bark, a wide receiver. Good one. Gail Gilbert back to throw it. Gets it off. Downfield. He's got a man. It's Andy Bark. It's a touchdown.
Gordon Bunch, number 15 of Arizona, misjudges the speed of Bart and the strength of the arm of Gilbert. As you can see, he let Bart run right by him for the touchdown, leading by 14 points. All he had to do was play deep. Quite frank, he said he thought this would be the toughest test for his team this season. Gilbert on a deep drop, good protection. Bark is there. Andy Bark inside the five. Here in Allen Durden, that this catch fan may be the greatest we've seen this year. Andy Bark, he forced out of bounds, but as long as he comes back inbounds immediately, he's eligible. Watch the concentration. He knows he's going to get hit. Watch him cradle the ball in. Take the blow, the immediate tackle. Three-point game. Fans, look at this catch. This may be the best we'll see all year. Mark number 42 is forced out of bounds. He can come back. Watch his concentration. He expects to get hit. He knows he's going to hit. He cradles the ball. He ducks his back, protects the ball from the tackler, and falls down for a sensational catch. Now, second down and eight, Gilbert looking to throw, gets his pass away, and it is incomplete, and the first time today he had looked for Andy Bark, the wide receiver. Andy Bark is an interesting youngster. He's from California. He, he went over to the Air Force Academy, and his first year over there, he caught 47 passes. So with that kind of ability, uh, the Air Force folks were willing to put up with some of his eccentricities, and I'll give you an example. When he showed up to enroll at the Air Force Academy, he showed up with a mohawk. Perfect. So the guys at the Academy <laughs> knew they had a little bit of a struggle going on there. But he's back in California, surfing again, and happy again. Hear that. Here's Gilbert with his pass to the sideline. Lucky to get it back. He threw it for Andy Bark, but Bark was well covered. He threw the ball well over the head of Bark, so probably just unloaded it to get rid of it. And we've got a cow man shaken up, and it's been down for Gail Gilbert throws back the other direction and completes the pass into the Stanford territory to Andy Bark at the 40 yard line. Slant in pattern sliding down at the one yard line is going to be Bark. The play fake here holds the linebacker so they can't jump in the air. That enables Gilbert to get the ball off without getting it batted down with that one step drop. And you see Bark. Lots of time for Gilbert. High in the air is Bark, and he comes down with it at midfield. Traffic, but Bark is a high jumper, and he hauls it in. Good gutsy pattern. You see Gilbert here. Tough throw for a quarterback. He's rolling out to his right, throwing back to the left, center of the field. You see Bark going up high between three Stanford defenders. Lobbing it to the end zone for Bark. to California. Gilbert's going to make a little play fake to try and freeze the backers. He goes with the timing pattern up in the air. Bark getting up in the air. He's got good leaping ability. Price with good coverage. It's a perfect throw, perfect pass. Good reception. California today, David Lewis, the All-American candidate at tight end. It's going to put more pressure on Andy Bark, who's coming off what might be his best game as a collegian. Andy is a really a good receiver. He's a possession receiver. He's really a lot like Carmack Carney, who played here last year. He does the things that re are really needed to make everything happen. He's one of the people you really want on your team. They have two timeouts left. Gilbert deep drop this time. Has all day to throw. Throws wide open. Andy Bark out of bounds at the 42. There's a pro catch. Man, giving him plenty of time to throw the ball. He's going to roll to his right on the play. Andy Bark is running a backside corner route, and Gil makes an excellent throw. And watch Andy keep his feet in bounds. That's a great grab. I said the 40. And Gilbert will put it up. Hitch pass for Bark. First down at the 48-yard line of San Jose. Around at one redshirt year. Gilbert rolls left, steps up, throws deep. That's Bark. Great grab at the 20. Down he goes to the 18-yard line. This play, a short roll. Neil Lugan throws an excellent block. And Andy Bark makes a great catch on this. go for it all. They slot Lewis this time, so that'll give him a little more operating room. And Gale looks over the middle. That's Bark at the 30-yard line. First down, California. 